What's going on everybody? My name's Steve. I'm going to be uh, the main video content producer for this channel. Welcome to Talking SPAC. Uh, Talking SPAC is going to be a channel that specializes in uh, special purpose acquisition company stocks. SPAC, SPAC mergers. The ones I like, the ones I don't, um, and my requirements on which SPACs I get involved with. Uh, to go ahead and get started, we will just basically go over what a SPAC is. A SPAC is an acronym for Special Purpose Acquisition Company. These Special Purpose Acquisition Companies are what they call blank check companies. What they do is they get a an investor or a group of investors to pull money into a corporation and they take that corporation public. Now when they take these acquisition companies and they take them public, they are commonly traded at a floor of $10. So you can get these companies, if you get to them early, you can get them for $10. And what the, what the equity company does is they find a private company that's interested in going public and they merge with them to take the private company public. So they have the, the blank check company, they acquire a target, which is a private company that, they, that the private company wants to go public, they merge, and once the merger happens, the special purpose acquisition company, the blank check company, goes away, and the private company starts trading under their public figure, which was the SPACs, uh, ticker symbol and once the merger happens the SPACs ticker symbol goes away and the private company comes up with a new ticker symbol and the private company is now public uh, these uh, these types of stocks and these type, type of mergers have become really popular over uh, the, about the past year um, it's a quicker much cheaper way for a company to go public versus going through an, an, an initial public offering or an IPO so they do these reverse, reverse reverse mergers to go public, and it gets them onto the stock market a lot faster. Um, some of the more prominent companies that are publicly traded now that went through a SPAC, um, DraftKings, they were a SPAC, uh, Virgin Galactic, Open Door, Fisker, Canoe. A lot of EV companies go through the go through the specs. Um, there was also EV charging, which was a charge point. They went through a spec, and a lot of these are successfully traded companies on the stock market now. But if you get in on these specs quick enough, you can get in at a close to the ten dollar floor and just either day trade them, swing trade them, or hold on to them until they go public and you know then you have an equity share in the private company uh, some not so good SPAC mergers that have happened uh, that aren't as successful um, Nikola Motors they were initially a SPAC um, that was one I wholeheartedly stayed away from because I looked into the CEO Trevor's history and backstory and it was not good and you could just see that that was going to be a complete disaster with him at the helm. Now, whether they can turn it around under new leadership, that, that remains to be seen. But in this first video, I just wanted to basically go over what a SPAC was, because that's what we're going to be talking about on this channel. And uh, I'll start going over some stocks that I like. Again, I am not a financial advisor. This should not be construed as financial advice. I'm only giving my opinions on which SPAC stocks I like, which SPACs I avoid. Should not be construed as financial advice. Please do all of your own research and invest in your own risk. We will be back with more stuff soon. Thank you very much, guys.